is the most hardest Pokemon to find in Pokemon X and Pokemon Y? Can you guess? I'll give you a hint. It's a fire and water type. That's right, folks. It's Volcanion. Volcanion is known as the Steam Pokemon and is one of the rarest and, mo and most strongest mythical Pokemon in the entire Pokeverse. You must know, Volcanion is the first one to be seen in the anime in the in the Pokemon movie, Volcanion and the Mechanical Marvel, featuring Magearna. If you, if you must know, Volcanion has a signature move called Steam Pulse, and, um, I don't know exactly what it does, but, um, Volcanion can't exactly, can't exactly attack without water. After its tanks are empty, it refills up every last power that it has. Okay, when you see it, when you're drawing him, make sure to add two nostrils here. And to add a jaw. Okay, so um, next thing you do, draw his hair, his ear. There's his head. Okay, so what next? Now let's see what else. What else? Um. Here, here's his next point. There's his, there's this thing where you stick out of his, his head. Next, you just draw. Okay, so um, the favorite thing that I like to draw is the crest above his head. That um thing above his head, that's the thing I like the most of all about him. Here's his Okay, here's his toe. Okay, so here's his foot. If you heard something, that's his that's his voice. 
truth is, I've heard rumors about how to catch Volcanion in Pokemon X and Y. That you have to catch a Meryl and bring it to a pool in one of the um, abandoned deserts in ones that are next to Team Flare. There's this pool where you bring the Meryl in and then volcan the water dries up and it turns into a Volcanion's pool and it reveals to be Volcanion himself. Then you have to battle and catch it. As we all know by now, Volcanion is like the hardest Pokemon in the game. But, um, you see, I've, I've realized that thing was just a lie. And you see, um, you see, uh, the real way to catch him is with a QR code event. Well, actually, that's McGearnut. You need to give it an actual code in order to get it. But, um, when I got mine, I asked for my buddy Summer to help me receive Volcanion. It wasn't exactly that bad, but I should really thank her for giving me the, the Volcanion file. But, um, I'm especially proud of the Volcanion card, which I have in my house. Um, one of these days I'm going to show you my entire collection. And, um, I'll show you how much has changed. Okay, so here's his next toe. Okay, so here's his back toe. Here's... Let me just, um, wrap this up. I, last thing I do is draw his tail. And... Basically, just gotta draw his foot down here. And that's how you draw a Volcanion. If you um like this video, make sure you leave a comment below. Internet, I wave you goodbye.